Hi everybody, Crafty Mama here, and today I'm going to show you a great craft that you can make to keep your box tops in if you save box tops for your kid's school. If you're anything like me, you end up tearing them off the box and throwing them all over the kitchen, and now I have a great idea where you can keep them all in one place. And the thing I really like about it is it reuses something that wouldn't necessarily be able to be recycled, and that is a formula can. I don't have any more babies left, but my sister-in-law does, and she goes through a ton of formula cans, and we were brainstorming trying to think of different things we could do with the formula cans to make them useful again, and we've come up with lots of ideas, and this is just one of the few first ideas that we're going to show you. So we're going to make a box top holder with this formula can. So what you want to do is take the wrapper off the formula can, and with some scrap of paper, and I'm making this to match my kitchen so that it could sit on my shelf and look really nice in my kitchen and I won't have box tops thrown everywhere. So you're going to cut your piece of paper to the size of your can. And unfortunately, the 12 by 12 scrap of paper does not go the whole way around the can. So we also need to cut an extra little piece to fit on there. So we're going to start with the little piece. You're moving too fast. And we're going to tape this on here. My daughter said I'm going too fast. You're, no, you're no, moving no too fast. And I can't catch that, you know? Like, whoa, whoa. So, here we go. I'm going to tape that little piece You on. just did it again. And then we're going to take the big piece and put a piece of tape on here. Fit this right on here. Run it around the can. And then I have some scrapbook stickers that match it. And I'm just going to go ahead really and take my stickers. Stick them on here. What we did with the lids is we actually spray painted the lids Ta-da. and they're still drying. So once the lids dry, we're going to cut slips, slips in the top so that you can just drop them in sort of like a bank. Just drop them right into your can. Box toes. And the other thing that we did is, um, if you want to, is a good idea, is to also make one for your teacher and give it to them so they can put it on their desk and collect the, the box tops in their room. And this is the one we made for the teacher to collect her box tops in on her desk. And we're going to take that to her on Tuesday and see what she thinks of that. So here's my very simple finished box tops can out of a formula can. And like I said, when the lids dry, we're just going to cut a slit in them so we can drop the box tops in them. It's going to look really nice in my kitchen. It's going to collect my box tops.